Hi everyone, I am Daniel Winterholzinger from Austria. I'm a professional sports better and today I'd like to talk to you about combo bets insurance. First of all, um, if I make some mistakes in written or speaking uh, form, I apologize um, for this because it's not so simple for me to explain it now in English, but I try my best. <clears throat> okay, everybody from you know what is a combo bet uh, in sports betting and this video um, was created by a real example I got um, an email from a viewer of my channel um, and he asked me if I can help him to make insurance of um, his combo bet and for this reason this uh, video um, was created and I want to start now for you how this works and that you can see the situation. Okay, now to the starting situation, this is the bet I got per email. It's like um, a combo bet with 11 games. And you can see here that the green ones are all right. So this are, uh, has been one and only three games are left so you see 5L Wolfsburg against first FC Köln he, he bets um, who will win the game and he says that Wolfsburg will win the game with an out of 1.5 uh, Villarreal against Deportivo La Coruña um, he bets uh, over one and a half goals and the last game it was Excelsior against Ajax Amsterdam where he played uh, over two and a half goals. Um, well, he invested in this um, ticket um, five euros and his possible payout if all games are right um, he will get 2684.29. And now in this video, I want to show you all necessary steps, how you can um, make insurance of that and how you calculate your insurance. And this is a teaching video, so you have to do all steps with me together, because if you're not doing that, uh, you will not know uh, at the end of the video how it will work. Okay, so I will invest a lot of time now in this video. I make with you all necessary steps and you can see in the video how this will work. Okay, to the starting situation um, I want to show you the situation what we have at the moment. So the first games um, you've seen before the green ones are all one so they are all right and if we want to see our um, situation at the moment, uh, if we multiplicate all odds together from 175 to 1.95, we get a total odd of 209.54 and his uh, total stack was 5 euros. Um, at the moment the ticket has a value at 1047.73 euros. If the three games which are remaining um, are right, he will win 2,684 euros and 29 cents. And this um, is a total odd of 536.86. Okay. So first of all, that we can make insurance, we have to know which is the risk of the open bets and at the first game, um, Wolfsburg against Köln, he, he, he bets um, that Wolfsburg will win the game. So we have the risk with the draw and with the situation if Köln will win the game. So we need for our insurance here the bet a double chance, um, draw or do. In the second game, at Villarreal against Deportivo La Coruña, he bets uh, over one and a half, one and a half goals. 
so we need um, the under one and a half goals and in the third game at Excelsior against Ajax Amsterdam we need for our insurance the under two and a half goals <coughs> in <laughs> in this special example now uh, what you see with me um, the viewer um, in the email um, told me that he has a bankroll of uh, only 500 euros and which steps are now in this situation necessary to generate the maximum possible guarantee profit uh, and this I will do with you um, together in uh, the next minutes okay what we need before we can start our calculations is we need all offered odds um, from our risk bets so we need for double chance draw and two we get offered an out of 2.6 um, Villarreal against La Coruña for under one and a half goals we get an odd of 3.8 and Excelsior against Ajax Amsterdam for under two and a half goals we get an odd of three this is very important because we need all these odds before we can start our calculation um, for this reason you have first to check um, which odds you get offered before we can start Okay, uh, many times I got um, the question where, where I find for free the best odds on the market. Um, for this reason I, I want to show you three pages where you can find, um, where you can compare the odds between the bookmakers. One of them is uh, www.oddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsoddsodd
now in the video and open the program Excel with me together. First of all, I want to show you the target where we want to go and this is this picture and it looks like very, um, oh my god. So don't worry, we make all steps together. This is only the picture where we want to go so that you can see what is our target. And for this reason, um, I open here now uh, Excel with you. Okay. First of all, what we have to do is to um, calculate a calculation factor. I named it calculation factor. Um, that we can see what are the necessary stakes um, for our three open bets. And for this reason, I do it with you together. So let us start here. Um, B2, it's date, it's time. So we need here team A against team B, our uh, bet, the odd, the stake, then we have the total profit, here we have the net profit, and to recover, the first game, the first game was on 20 December 2014, it was at 1830 um, VFL Wolfsburg against uh, Erste FC Köln. It's the double chance draw and two with an odd of 2.6. Then the second game was 21 December 2014 at 12 it's Villarreal against um, Deportivo La Coruña it's under one and a half goals with an odd of 3.8 the third game was also on 21 December at 1430 against Ajax Amsterdam under two and a half goals with an odd of three so I'll prepare here a little bit better our interface okay very important first of all before we can start doing um, this insurance is that all games have are not at the same time okay so we need time between the games um, for doing uh, this calculation if a game is together with other game um, you cannot do uh, this technique and the necessary calculation for that because you not know if they are at the same game at 12 and this is at 12 for example um, you not know how the first game will finish and for this technique we have to know how the game will finish before we can make the, the next uh, bet in the in the following game Okay, so this is very important um, for for doing this technique. And now we try to make a calculation factor. Um, what we have to do first is that we have um, a net profit is has to be the same in all three games. So for this reason. Um, I put here the, the number one so that we have the same net profit in all three games and 
the first formula what we need for our calculation is how high we have to bet at the citation double chance draw and two with an odd of 2.6 to win a net profit of one. So for this reason we need the calculation the net profit divided by the odd minus one. So you see here um, the formula over there and with return we get um, the result. So we had we have to invest six to five cents to get a net profit of one. So our total profit, this is the amount what you get pay out from the bookmaker. So our total profit is um, the stake multiplicated by the odd. So you see you get paid out one euro six two five but if you subtrahate the stake, um, you win uh, one euro for net profit. To recover, this means if, this, if the first bet is wrong from our insurance, how much we have to win in the second round. And for this reason, we need the formal is the net profit plus the stake, what we have lost in the first round. The result is 1.625. In the second round, we have to invest is the money what we have to recover divided by the odd of 3.8 minus 1 and we get the result 0 0.58035714 so this would be the amount what we have to bet in the second round to receive the total profit in the second round we have to multiplicate the stake with the art and our result is 2 euro 25 3 and so on the net profit is one the reason is you get paid out 2 euros 20 but if you make a sum of our stakes you see that we have here a total investment of 1 euro 253 so if you make a separation of 220 minus 1253 our net profit is 1 and to recover uh, for the third round if the second round is wrong um, we have to make following calculation we need the net profit plus the stake from the second round, what we have lost, plus the stake from the first round. And the result for our calculation in the third round is 225.371.4. So the stake for the third round would be this amount, what we have to recover, divided by the odd minus 1. So you see here, our stake would be one euro and ten twenty-six seventy-eight fifty-seven, and our total profit um, would be the stake from the third round multiplicated by the odd, and we receive the amount three point thirty-eight. Um, I calculation factor so it's the sum from our uh, stakes
from our three stakes what we need and you see our um, factor is now 2.3080357.1 um, and our net profit after the third round is also one so we get a total payout of 3 euro 30 but if we subtrahate the 230 it's already one and well this is um, what you see here the calculation factor is 230 uh, 8035714 okay so the next step um, what we need is that we have to create a basic win um, a basic win or a hatch win in combo bats is possible to calculate with our calculation factor what we have done now with the number of 2.3080357.4 and the formal um, for for the basic win is the bankroll what we have free it's the 500 euros what I told you before this is the amount what we have available for this insurance divided by our factor what we have now calculated and the result here is 216 euro 63 so in this example it is now possible to generate it a guarantee minimum net profit of 216 euro 63 less our combo bet stake this I want to explain you a little later um, now we have to change our existing calculation in following way that we see how much we have to invest in in all uh, three games um, This is our final picture, what we want to reach. This is our arbitrage situation for this example. Um, there you can see um, all three games and the calculated stakes for each round. And this I want to do with you together um, here in our uh, Excel calculation. So okay I will make a copy um, from that and I will do it here um, first of all sorry first of all what we have to write here is our bankroll um, it's 500 euros and our basic win um, it's the bankroll what we have available divided by our calculation factor what we have generated so this is 216.63 and now um, I'm, I want to make a copy here so over there and this one over here so our net profit is should be on each game the same so we can say uh, it's i i9 in this case or it's eight now it's nine so and with f4 you see that here we have a dollar between the the name of the E9. So if you go over there on the right, you get a, a black plus. So you can drop down here to um, the three games, and you see it's always 216.63. Our stake for the first round 
we need following calculation. It's our basic win multiplicated by our stake, what we have calculated over there, um, multiplicated with 0 0.625. So our stake for the first round for double shunts draw and two at the odd of 2.6 is 135.39 and our total profit is the stake multiplicated by the odd. So you see we get paid out 352 euros and uh, 3 cents and if we make a subtraction to uh, of 135.39 we had a net profit of 216.63. Okay, to recover we need our net profit plus our stake, what we have lost in the first round. So we have to recover in the second round if the first round is wrong 352 and 3 cents the stake for the second round is our basic win multiplicated by this uh, this number what we have generated before multiplicated with 0 0.58 and so on and we received the result 125.72 our total profit is the stake multiplicated by the odd. So we get paid out 477.75 if we have to invest in the second round at the odd of 3.8 and if the uh, bet is uh, right. So when you make a sub subtraction <laughs> of our stakes, so these two amounts we have invested is a total amount of 261.12 and 477 minus 261 it's also a net profit of 216.63 and to recover for the third round if the second round is also wrong we need our net profit plus our uh, stake from the second round plus our stake from the first round which we have lost here the first two rounds so we have to recover in the third round 477.75 the stake the calculated stake for the third round is the basic win multiplicated by the factor of 1.10 so in the third round we have to invest 238.87 and the total profit is the stake multiplicated by the odd and you see that we get paid out 716 euros and 63 and our total stake what we here need for all three bets is the the sum of all three stakes and if you do that you see that we invest here exactly 500 euros what we have available for um, this insurance and if the third round is right you see we get paid out 716 euros 63 minus our 500 euros which we have invested in all three games so uh, we have a net profit from 216 euro 63 um, and yes and this is the way how you can calculate um, this situation so I want to um, here that we have uh, euros and um, that it looks like a little bit pretty so okay um, well the next step what we have to do so you can see first here um, this is now the same picture um, what we have prepared together um, and the next step is a what-if analysis.
to see our success, it is always necessary to do a what if analysis. And this I also want to do with you um, together now. Okay. Okay. So I will copy this over here. Then first game over there. The stake. Then um, here and so. Okay, then we have here the what if analyze. The first analyze what we do is if our bet for what we have done for the insurance with the double chance draw and two has one. So what happens here? If this bet has won, our combo bet has lost. So we lost here 5 euros. Our single bet has won the total profit of 352.03. So this amount is always stake multiplicated by the odd. So we get paid out 352.03. We have to reduce it with our uh, stake, what we have needed. So it's 135.40 multiplicated by minus 1, so that we have a negative number and our net profit is here the sum of these three amounts and you see here it's a 211.63 so okay that we have to make here let us do it green you see, we have won our basic win of 216.63, but we have to reduce um, this with the um, initial stake, what we have bet at the combo bet. So these 5 euros are lost, so we won a net profit of 211.63. But what happens if the bet lost? If the bet lost, our combo bet is still open so only two games are missing um, we have lost our stake from the first round so this is 135.40 and to recover the first round we have to win back the 135.40 and our basic win basic win and this is 216.63 so it's necessary the necessary win for round 2 is the sum of these two amounts so it's 352.03, the same what we have um, here, um, what we have calculated before. Okay, this is our first what if analyze. So this means in the first round we invest 135.40 in the double chance draw or two. If it's draw and two, we won 
our single bet here and our net profit is 211.63 if this happens we have no further bets so it's over if the bet lost we have to calculate uh, what we have to win in the second round and we have to make our second bet so in the second round I'll copy this here um, the second game second game then the stake is 125.73 so the what if analyze if the bet has won what happens then if the bet has won our combo bet has lost so we have here minus five euros our single bet of um, the under one and a half goals was right, so total profit is now 477.76. It's again odd multiplied by the stake. Then we have to reduce this amount. by our uh, stake what we have needed um, this is 125.73 and we have to reduce it from the stake of the first round in this case it was 135.40 and our uh, net profit is again the sum of all this amounts and you see here again that uh, we will win uh, 211.63 if the second bet is right so we won our insurance and re recover with the 477 euros all our stakes and our planned uh, net profit if the bet has lost the combo bet is still open it's so only one game is missing but we have lost the stake from the round one so we have here a minus of 135.40 and we have lost the stake of the round two. Okay, let me give here a one. So it's here um, 125.73. Uh, this is a total amount of 261.12 to recover both rounds we need 261.12 plus our basic win our basic win is 216.63 so necessary win for round 3 is the sum of these two amounts and it's 477.76 it's the same what we have calculated over there uh, okay this is the second what if analyze if the the first game has lost so Wolfsburg has won we have to place the second bet here at Villarreal Rega Rila for under one and a half goals so if under one and a half goals happened we get paid out 
177.76 and when we reduce all our uh, amounts from the combo bet and our uh, initial stakes we have also a profit of 211.63 okay and the last the last one the last analyze is at the third game okay let's copy over there um, okay we need here a stake and we need here the amount of 238.88 okay then what if analysis the bet has won so if this happens this is the last game so if the game Ajax Amsterdam is under two and a half goals our combo bet has lost so we lost here five euros our uh, single bet has won with a total profit from 716.63 it's again odd multiplicated by the stake then we have to reduce this amount with our stake from the third round so this is 238.88 we have to reduce this amount from the second round so we also lost this amount here we have to reduce it from the first round um, 135.40 and if we calculate now the net profit so it's the sum of all these amounts you see we will win again 211.63 so it's always the same amount in all three situations and if now the bet has lost the combo bet uh, won was right so we get paid out at the bookmaker bookmaker 2684.29 but we have to reduce it with our stake from the round one which we have lost from the insurance so it's this amount we have to reduce it with the stake from the round two it's 125.73 and we have to reduce it with the round number three so it's 238.88 and our net profit after all three rounds is 2184.29 and the bankroll needed for the insurance is now the sum of these three amounts which we have placed so you can see here that we have fulfilled all um, criteria so that we have only a bankroll of 500 euros and that we will win in all three situations um, the same amount if one bet is um, wrong from our combo bet okay and yes this is now what we see here for this reason we need our analyze 
um, the what if analyze from each situation. Um, so you, if you do that, you know what happens and you are not scared about um, what could be if this happens and if this happens. So this is very important to do um, this analyze uh, before you start placing your bets. So this is the second analyze what we have done together and this is the uh, third analyze. Um, very important is now what the closing remarks are. So please stay a little bit longer, it's only a couple of minutes. But this is very important before you can use um, this strategy and some tips what I want to give you. If your insurance are change, it's possible to lose money with this technique. Um, what I mean with that? Well, you can remember at first we have to find out our three odds before we make the calculation. So these three odds are generally in the future. You see here, we have here the 20th of December and um, this is on the 21st of December. So this is two days later or one day later and let us say we have to make this calculation on the 19th of December so we need the odds from the future and if the odds change in the future because we have to use this odd um, first if the game happens okay so we have to wait the first round the second round and in the third round we need the odd of three and if this odd change let us say it falls down to 2.5 um, you invest 238.88 in the odd of 2.5 you will not win 716.63 you will win less so it will reduce your net profit okay if the odd change too much uh, it could happen that your net profit is zero or in the minus Okay, this is very important that you know um, this before you can do that. Okay. Um, the other way is if the art is rising up, you can generate a higher profit. Okay, because the reason was that our bankroll of 500 euros um, we have no more money to make a further bet, so it should not be higher than 500 euros and for this reason I cannot take a higher stake if the odd is falling down to 2.5 for example if the odd of 3 to 2.5 what I show you before um, well this is also very very important all insuring games have to be taking place one after the other this is what I told you before um, if you have two games at the same time it not works Okay, because you need the result of each game and after the result of each game you can make a further bet. Um, yeah. <laughs> this is also what I want to explain you. With this technique you spend a lot of money on the long term, in the long run, to your bookmaker. Let me explain why it is. Let us say, first of all, every bookmaker has a margin on on his odds and first you placed a, odd, uh, a bet of under one and a half goals let us say with an odd of um, eight, 1.8 only for example and now you say it's over one and a half goals also at the odd of 1.8 for example so you can see if you place on each side 100 euro for example uh, you invest 200 euros but you get paid out 180 so you have lost 20 euros to the bookmaker okay um, and this this is very important that you know with the margin of the bookmakers odds and doing this technique for sure you will win money but you will also um, spend a lot of money in the long term to your bookmaker 
Also very important is play all calculated bets what you have done and never forget one. Why? I want to show you here one more. Let us say you play the first bet with 135.40 and the first bet was wrong. So you lost 135.40. In the second round you bet 125.73 and it was also wrong so it was over so you also lost this amount so we have total loss 261 12 and in the third round you say ah, come on I want to wait uh, it would be get over two and a half goals and you not place the bet or you you forgot to place the bet and now the bet was right so you're definitely in minus. Why? Because you not win 716.63, for example. So you you have lost your five euros from the combo bet, and you have lost these two bets, these two. So 261.12. So we have a total prof, uh, a total minus of uh, 266.12 if you not play the third um, round. So this is very very important um, that you keep your money free the 500 euros for this three bets okay if you not do that um, you are in danger that you can lose here a lot of money um, okay well that's for me um, thank you all for listening um, and if you have some questions, um, email me or write a comment under the video. Um, yeah, I wish you the best of luck in all your bets and bye bye.